I chose naturopathic medicine more because it chose me. Since I was a child, I knew I wanted to be a doctor and a healer. Uh, my dad was the uh, charge nurse in the ICU at the hospital where we lived. And I would just go and listen to the patients, go at night, do rounds with him, and see what was being done to help them get better, what their issues were. And that was always something that I knew that I was meant to do. So I knew medicine was for me, but at that time, conventional medicine was all I really knew. When I was in high school, I had a severe spinal injury during a sporting event. I was being told to take all these medicines and, and do all these things that just didn't feel right. And so I refused the medications and just you know, dealt with the pain and physical therapy and the back braces and all those things that were necessary. And I'm very thankful that I did that because two years later, uh, the particular medication that they were really trying to get me to take was actually taken off the shelf. And so I was very glad in that moment that I listened to my intuition, but then I also wanted to find something else that could substitute for that. So I grew up using herbs and different things with my grandmothers, so I was always familiar with that. And it showed me that there was a way out there to accomplish these amazing things with health that were not necessarily surgical and pharmaceutical. So I started looking into how to do that. I came across naturopathic medicine and I realized it was everything that I had wanted all rolled into one. So it was just the right fit for me. My name is Dr. Christy Soto Johnson. I'm a naturopathic physician at Guiding Elements Medical Center in Phoenix, Arizona. I specialize in energy medicine and I also perform family medicine. And I help people to transform their lives and their health into reaching the potential that they can fulfill. The human body is absolutely amazing that it has these mechanisms to self-heal and repair when we can give it the right conditions to do so. I'm always in awe when I see a patient go from very ill or depressed or all of these absolutely unbearable conditions to having a normal life, being able to smile, or just being able to go up the stairs when they haven't been able to do that for years. It's very inspiring to me to keep me going in what I do and to keep seeking people who need help. As naturopathic physicians, we have a very wide tool bag to choose from. We have conventional therapies, you know, standard labs, all these different things that people are accustomed to in Western medicine. But then we also have a wide variety of tools and treatment uh, modalities available from Eastern medicine, Chinese medicine, just a huge variety of alternative systems. And the beauty of that is that this makes Guiding Elements a one-stop shop. You know, a person can come here, they can get their prescriptions updated and get all of their labs and everything up to date and make sure that everything is healthy physiologically. And then at the same time, they can then receive, you know, therapeutic massage or counseling or all these different things that are needed to make the entire person healthy and not just address a symptom. For us to help a patient determine if they're ready to take this journey and take these next steps, we have what we call a collaboration inquiry call. So that is where a person can have a free 15 minute consult with us over the phone and we get a brief kind of background as to what their concerns are, what they've tried, and it gives us a sense of what they're willing to do. So if a person is not ready to make significant changes in their life as a permanent lifestyle change and not just a temporary quick fix, that helps us to decide, okay, are they, they might be ready right now and we are the right fit. Or if it turns out they're not ready or if they're not the right fit, then we provide resources and other connections to help them to get to the place where they need to be to be ready. And we're always here once they are ready.